What did you think of the lecture, Amy? It was really interesting, Jack, especially the part about gene editing. I was born with asthma and it's no fun, I can tell you. The idea that we'll be able to remove the bad genes responsible for diseases from an unborn baby is a huge advance for medical science. I know that some people disagree with it now, but I think everyone will be doing it in the future. I know what you mean, but it's not that simple, is it? What do you mean? There might be problems. Removing one gene from a cell may affect the other genes. Each of our cells contains a huge amount of information. How do we know that by taking out a bad gene from a cell? The scientists are not also taking out a good one. They have no idea what damage that could cause. Genetic editing is a major breakthrough, Jack. I'm sure that in the future the scientists won't make mistakes. You can't be sure about that. Look at Jurassic Park. What? That's a film. That could never happen. I know it's a film, but they used gene editing in it to create the dinosaurs. They created something they couldn't control, and it destroyed them. I've read that scientists are trying to revive dinosaurs for real now. That can't be a good idea, can it? Okay, I get your point. We have to be careful with any new science. We don't know what people will use it for, but that's true of every discovery and invention since the Stone Age. To be honest, Amy, I can't decide whether altering DNA is a good thing or not. They're also considering using the science to bring back other extinct species. Not ones from millions of years ago, but more recently extinct ones, like the woolly mammoth. Now that's something I'd love to see. A hairy elephant 